Hey coaches, this is Neil with Anytown Soccer Training. In this video, I want to go over how the player profiles work for yourself as a coach, your players, and your families. So let's begin. First, I suggest you always sign in via the single sign-in. So you go to the website and you click sign in and then sign in via the single sign-in. When you sign in via the single sign-in, you'll see all the profiles that you have created. So let me take a time out and pause here to clarify how it works for parents and the difference between parents and parents who are also coaches. So we ask everyone to, to create at least one player profile. So most of your parents will only create a player profile for their child. So for example, I have two children in my household, Adam and Matthew, and they both have their player profiles. However, since I'm a coach of a team and I want to manage that team, I also added another player profile called Coach Anytime. That allows my two sons who are in my household to be on that team as players and me to be on that team as the team manager. To add a player profile, you simply click add player profile and fill out the information. The contact email can be the same email as you've used before. This is the email we send out alerts or information about the team. The birth year can be any birth year and pick your own avatar or upload your photo. It's best to give a screen name that your team recognizes. Once you've done that, you go back and log in via the respective Profile. If I wanted to simply train Adam, I would log in as Adam. If I wanted to train Matthew, I would log in as Matthew. And if I needed to do something specific with my team, I would log in as my coaching profile. Again, the only difference between the profiles is their relationship to the team. So watch this. I log in as my coaching profile. I go to my teams. I hit roster and I have access to the edit teams button. When I click to sign homework, the team pops up and I can just click here and assign the homework to that team. And when I go to my homework, the homework would appear here and I can assign homework throughout the process. I can also, as the manager of that team, send a notification to the team that they have homework. As the team manager, I can also create the team contest. I am literally managing that team. However, Anyone can technically create their team and become a manager of that team. All the profiles work the same. But now let me log in as Matthew and watch the slight difference. Matthew is a player on the team. So he hits my team. He goes to the roster and you will see Matthew as a player on the team, whereas my profile is a coach on the team. So if Matthew wanted to pin a folder or if I wanted to pin a folder on behalf of Matthew and I click the pin button, it would just go straight to his favorites. He does not have the ability to assign homework. It just goes to his favorites. But the homework that I assign to the team appears in Matthew's homework folder. If you have any questions about this, please reach out to me or Megan or any of our onboarding specialists and we will help you out. And remember, you really only have to do this one time because once you're set up with your profiles, they last forever. Thanks for watching and let's get better together.